So we've got really big aspirations at Art Marine. Our plan is to be the market leader in nature-based solutions for the marine environment. We had in our mind that we were wanting to develop a, a non-plastic rope alternative. Some of the equipment used to test that and to manufacture it is really expensive. So National Composite Centre was instrumental in developing the mineral and natural rope. My name is Tom Burbeck. I'm the co-founder and CEO of Art Marine. Art Marine is an eco-engineering company which specialises in designing, building, installing and monitoring nature-based solutions for the marine environment. Problems we're trying to solve in offshore construction is that a lot of materials used aren't fit for the marine environment. So what we do is we design with nature in mind and we devise structures that protect subsea assets like offshore wind farms, subsea cables, uh, coastal defence but we also make sure that it makes a, a biodiversity benefit for the marine environment and its organisms. The challenge that Arc Marine have is that for each marine map that they introduce into the ocean, they also need to provide 140 metres of plastic rope to help tie these structures together and keep them secure. Our engineers used their material and process selection expertise to trial a number of different combinations of both mineral and natural fibres to see which would perform best in the harsh ocean environment. The non-polypropylene rope that we've created together is a mixture of mineral and natural materials. So it involves a mineral inner core and then a natural outer braiding to protect it. And what this means is that we don't use any plastics in any of the components, which means it should be a lot safer for the marine environment. It's also got a lower carbon footprint than polypropylene as well. Our work with the UK SME manufacturing community has grown exponentially over the past three years. We're now delivering over 80 projects every year and we're supporting over 200 micro, small and medium organisations on an annual basis. Every day we're working with companies large and small to help work towards a net zero future. Having a research centre who were interested in supporting an SME for no other reason but to support an SME was really useful because without their resources, their equipment and their knowledge, we may have missed the boat in terms of the industry would have adopted it or changed or pivoted before Art Marine had time to, to come up with a solution. <laughs>